top seven legendary armors that have stood the test of time, throughout history, warriors across the globe have crafted extraordinary armors for protection and prestige. From ancient Greece to the Pacific Islands, these designs reflect the ingenuity and culture of their creators. Here are seven remarkable examples. 1. Dendra Armor, 3,500 years old, discovered in 1960 near the village of Dendra in southern Greece. This Mycenaean armor dates back to approximately 1500 BC. Made from over 10 bronze plates connected by leather straps, the armor shielded its wearer from neck to knee, with additional protection for the arms and shins. Warriors also donned a helmet crafted from wild boar tusks. Archaeologist Barry Malloy tested a replica of the Dendra armor and found it effective in simulated battle scenarios inspired by the Trojan War. The large neck guard and helmet provided comprehensive protection for the head and neck, making it a remarkable feat of ancient engineering, too. King Tut's leather armor, 3,300 years old, found in the tomb of the Egyptian pharaoh Tutankhamun, this suit of leather armor is thought to date back to around 1323 BC. Its design, resembling a cloak of overlapping leather scales, likely offered flexibility and protection, while paintings in King Tut's tomb depict him wearing the armor during chariot battles and hunts, scholars believe these scenes may be symbolic rather than literal. As there's no evidence that the young pharaoh participated in combat. 3. Chinese Fish Scale Armor 2,500 years old, unearthed in a tomb in the Yanghai Cemetery near the Taklamakan Desert, this armor is made from thousands of overlapping leather scales, mimicking the protective qualities of fish skin. The arid desert conditions preserved the armor exceptionally well. Patrick Wortman, an archaeologist at the University of Zurich, is currently recreating a replica to study its functionality, highlighting the ingenuity of ancient Chinese craftsmanship. 4. Serbian Larika Squameta Armor, 1,700 years old, this Roman scale armor, known as Larika Squameta, was discovered at the Timicum Minus archaeological site in eastern Serbia. Unlike the articulated Larika segmentata, the Squameta offered flexibility and was often used by higher-ranking soldiers or even emperors. Depictions of Roman leaders wearing this type of armor can be found in sculptures and paintings, showcasing its significance within the Roman military. 5. Japanese Yoroi Armor, 700 years old, the Oyoroi, meaning Great Armor, was a signature of Japan's samurai class during the 12th to 19th centuries. This elaborate armor, often worn on horseback, featured beautifully decorated iron plates and leather. One famous example was donated by Ashikaga Takaji, the first shogun of the Ashikaga shogunate, to a temple near Kyoto in the 14th century. Over time, these armors became treasured family heirlooms, symbolizing the samurai's legacy. 6. Kiribati Armor, 300 years old. On the Pacific islands of Kiribati, warriors crafted armor from coconut fiber mats and helmets made from dried pufferfish. With limited resources, they used available materials ingeniously to create effective protection for ritual combat. This unique armor, also found in neighboring islands like Nauru and Tuvalu, began to decline in the 19th century with the arrival of European missionaries. 7. Ned Kelly's Steel Armor, 145 years old. Australian outlaw Ned Kelly wore a homemade suit of armor during his infamous final stand in 1880. Crafted from repurposed steel plowshares, the armor protected Kelly's head and torso but left his arms and legs exposed. During a gunfight with police, the armor absorbed 18 bullets but couldn't prevent Kelly's capture after he was shot in the limbs. The armor, now on display at the State Library of Victoria, remains a symbol of Kelly's audacious rebellion. These armors not only served as protective gear but also as testaments to the creativity and adaptability of their creators. They tell stories of cultures, battles, and the unyielding human spirit throughout history. Thank you for reading. If you enjoyed learning about these historic armors, please like, subscribe, and stay tuned for more fascinating insights into history and culture.